Hello, this is a short video showing you how to use the Trial Schedule Builder. Log into your My Missouri State and select the Registration tab. Click on the Trial Schedule Builder link. Select your term and click Save and Continue. Near the top of the page, you can select various criteria such as course status, part of term, campus, or modality to help narrow down your schedule options. Select the Add Course button. Add courses to your schedule by selecting a subject, then a course number from the drop-down menus, then clicking Add Course. Continue this process to create a full schedule of courses, then select the Back to Generate Schedules button. If needed, you can also create breaks in your schedule by selecting the Add Break button. Enter a name, start time, end time, and days on which the break should occur. Select the Add Break button to save your break. Repeat this process to create as many breaks as needed. Selecting the Sections button will allow you to view all sections of your course. Uncheck any sections that you would not like to include in possible schedules. Select the Generate Schedules button to automatically build class schedules based on the criteria you chose. A list of schedules will appear. By placing your cursor over a schedule's magnifying glass icon, you can see a preview of that schedule in a grid format. Select the View link next to each schedule to view that schedule in more detail. Once you have found your desired schedule, select the Send to Shopping Cart button. This will send your selected classes to the registration system. When the registration system opens, select the term you are registering for and click Continue. Then select the Plans tab. Click the Add button next to each course to add it to your summary panel. Once you have added all classes to your summary panel, click Submit to register. Successfully registered courses will show a status of registered in green. Any errors that prevent registration will appear on the upper right corner of your screen. If your class has a registration error, you will see that the course is highlighted in red in the summary panel and the class information also appears in the error message itself. If you have registration errors and wish to remove the course from your registration summary, Click Submit again and the class will disappear.